today is the 30th of March and it's a Monday, nearly the end of the month, and welcome to Dex FX Markets. Okay, we're here for the signal results for the last week and month and 24 hours. Okay, moving straight on, here we go. So far for the last 24 hours, uh, only one hasn't fired off. But the rest are looking pretty damn good. Last seven days, nothing below 85% for the statistics, and that would be the Great British Band uh, JPY. And for the month, which is the last 30 days, everything is well into the 90% uh, for the asset statistics. And again, I would expect nothing less for our daily signals. Okay, moving on to the one hour TNT. And the one hour TNT is for trend, negate, and trade. Uh, these are obviously filed off on the hour. So far, three, four, five, six have been fired off. And the other four are at a 100%. And for the week, seven days, the lowest statistic is 75%, and that again is Great British fans, JPY. I'm sure that will catch up once we have our first signals firing off today. And for the month, the last 30 days, the lowest statistic is 83, 83.3. 83.3 is the lowest statistic, and that would be the AUD the USD. But again, everything here is actually quite superb. I take all my data that I use for trading uh, from the monthly, i.e. the 30 days from our results, and which is why I get such superb results, manually trading, and of course, using the bot. Moving on to our two hour assets. Statistics, quite a few not fired off, only two have fired off uh, so far today, but they've both been 100%. Okay, moving on for the last seven days, <coughs> the lowest is a Great British Fan JPY, and that is at 50%, and the one after that is 66.7, which is the USD CHF. Uh, really not bad for the last seven days, considering the amount of news and abusive news um, and false news and everything else that happens in the world today uh, that's pretty good snap statistics for last week and certainly for the month i mean we are just killing it absolutely killing it the only one really that slowed us down a bit is the usd cad but that has funnily enough for probably about the past month i've noticed it's had a very poor rate but then again at 76.9 that's as good as 77 percent uh, not too, too poor. Not shabby at all, really, in the big scheme of things. And moving on to the five minutes, uh, this little beastie here, uh, so far only 34 have fired off for the day. Uh, but out of those, the low statistic, asset statistic is 83.3, and that's the Euro USD. The last seven days, everything's in the 90%, and of course, the month would be in the 90%. Okay, moving back to our homepage. Uh, I have had somebody ask me, why do I show the asset statistics and not uh, the signal results from our signals? So what I'll quickly do is I'll pop over uh, to our signals and just show you that we actually have nothing to hide. Statistics are great, they can be manipulated. We don't like to do that sort of thing. Okay, uh, for the live daily signals, Obviously the green are winning and the blues are ones that have lost, being open and transparent. I will scroll through for the last 50. There you go, we've had two losses there and two losses there. Uh, moving on to the one hour. And we shall have a look down here. <coughs> now there's two that fired up already this morning. Coming down, but well, we had a loss in the last 50. We had Two losses in the last 50, three losses in the last 50 trades. I mean, so just keeping open and honest here. We believe in transparency. Now, of course, with the 
to our here we go well we had three but that was on the 27th so that was a few days ago and i know there's a lot of mess with the market let's do the last 50 the last 50 trades still only three out of 50. i mean <laughs> come on people uh, that's a two hours and the five minute rule. <laughs> really pointless looking at the five minutes. It, they're so quick and you've got to be uh, a certain mindset to actually trade them anyway. But looking down, our signals are actually spot on. Okay, so we've had one loss there out of the 50. Okay, there. That's only because somebody asked me. Um, what I will ask you to do though is if you've stumbled across this video, uh, if you'd like to like it and share it even but subscribe to my youtube channel and the reason i tell you to do that is we'd very much appreciate it we'd like to keep you up to date and informed with everything that's happening and just to let you know i've heard through the grapevine mm -hmm, through the grapevine there's a big announcement happening from dex fx markets that will affect absolutely every trader okay and it's good news so have a great day. Have a great Monday. Uh, rest of the week. Trade well. Trade safely. And this is Paul signing off.